Welcome to this introduction to CAD Corp CIS Desktop. This software is a fully functional desktop GIS, which can be deployed on your local hardware or hosted in the cloud. In this video, we'll explore the interface and provide an overview of its capabilities. When you launch the software, you have several options to help you get started. You can start with a blank map with no data. You can start with a template with a base map. On the left hand side, you can launch a previously saved project file. A project file is called a saved workspace definition, or SWD for short. Now, in terms of the interface, the software uses the Fluent Ribbon Interface from Microsoft. This provides a user friendly experience by grouping functionality into separate tabs for easier navigation. You can also switch the ribbon between the classic view to the simplified view by selecting this arrow in the far bottom right corner. There are also options to create your own custom tabs as well, where you can group your most commonly used tools into a single tab. From the Home tab, you can add overlays into your project. The software supports over 300 data formats, from GIS files to CAD formats, connections to databases, OGC compliant web services, and raster data, to name but a few. A list of supported formats can be viewed from the support section of the CAD Court website. Also available from the Home tab, you can style the overlays, you can create thematic maps, and you can use a query builder to perform attribute and spatial queries. You've got access to map controls for zooming in and out on the map. You can pan the map. There are selection tools for interrogating data, and there are also tools for measuring areas and lines. The Create tab provides tools for drawing and editing data. There are simple and advanced tools for point, line and polygon features. If you want to manage a topological network for routing, for example, then the topology tab gives you the tools to do this. The analysis tab gives you Boolean operations such as union and subtract. You can also create buffers or cartogram visualizations. And as part of the core product, we offer hotspot analysis, view shed analysis and tools for routing along a network. The software also includes CAD functionality and under the view tab gives you access to the table view behind your data and you can also view data in a 3D window. You can also show additional windows which includes the use of Python and SQL language within the software. And the final tab is applications. You can download free add-ins from the CAD Corp website and they will appear in this tab. Examples include the routing tools print workshop and book plotter. I also want to point out the file menu to you. There are some really useful tools that I want to make you aware of. From the info menu, this includes a report and benchmark tools. These are tools that report on the performance of your project files. Repair and maintenance helps you fix broken connections to data. One example is where data has been moved to a new corporate share. In regards to your projects, you can start new projects, open previously saved projects, or save your current project. You can also access the print template wizard to create your own maps for printing. You can design print templates how you like them and include your corporate branding. You can then publish these out to PDF for storing or sharing electronically. We have additional options to create laid PDFs and export the attributes. You can also export data to several GIS and CAD formats. You can also export to a supported database as well. Support includes SQL Server, PostGIS and Oracle Spatial. Alternatively, in conjunction with the Geognosis product, you can serve data out as an OGC compliant web service. And finally, within the file menu, I'm going to point you to utilities. For customers in Great Britain who use Ordnance Survey mapping data, the software includes several tools for processing and managing some of their data products. And finally, if I return back to the mapping interface, in the top right hand corner is this question mark. This provides a link to the CAD Corp online help, where you can access further information and guidance for using the software. That concludes this introduction video to CAD Corp CIS Desktop. Further information is available on our website, or if you'd like to discuss your requirements further, please contact us by email or telephone. 
CAD Corp can also provide software demonstrations on request.